Ain't no better man for this hot track. It's the veteran taking the mic back. David Letterman even said he liked that track, man. Pick it even though he ain't a rap fan. Black radio, he won't play me though. Ever since summertime, they ain't like none of mine. Even though the fans were on bald enough, guess they think that Will ain't hard enough. Maybe I should just to have a shootout, run up in the bank, bus, grab another loot out, creep somebody ass, taking my boot out, right on TV so all y'all can see me, just ignorant, attacking, acting rough, I mean, that will I be black enough? Ooh, wait, maybe I'll jack a truck, full of cigarettes and guns and drugs and stuff, get back, I wish I would've made that, lean back, I wish I would've made that, I wish I would've told the girl to drop it like it's hot, summer, summer, talk to you all I got, that is what this is, okay? This is ridiculous. And mind you, it is the current year. People, more more specifically, SJWs, NPCs, whatever the hell you want to call them. This is what, like, they're always trying to find a reason to be outraged, okay? Will Smith casting as Venus and Serena Williams' father sparks colorism backlash. Okay, I mean, seriously, though, are you really that insecure? Let's read this, okay? Smith is reportedly going to play, well, Venus and Serena's father in a new project. Will Smith is at the center of controversy following a report from Deadline that says he is attached to play Venus and Serena Williams' father and tennis coach Richard Williams in an upcoming biopic, biopic? Huh, never heard that word, titled King Richard. The spec script for the film, written by Zach Balin, reportedly earned a lot of attention and was picked up by Tim White and Trevor White. Okay. And to produce uh, through their star thrower entertainment banner. Smith is also producing through Overbrook Entertainment. Okay. Uh, the story of uh, Richard Williams. Wait, oh, okay, so the story is about the dad, okay? The story of King, oh, Richard Williams is notable as he had no prior test experience before coaching Vince and Serena, and arguably two of the greatest tennis players in history. While telling Williams' story, or while telling Williams' story may be exciting, the reported casting of Smith in the main role has led to backlash and accusations of colorism. Sports writer Clarence Hill Jr. went viral on social media after bringing attention to this casting writing. Colorism matters. Love Will Smith, but there are other black actors for this role. Okay, I'm gonna I'm pause. I'm gonna stop right there. <sighs> Again, these people are always trying to find reason to be upset. I mean, is, is he as dark as the dude? No, but I mean, he is Will Smith. These people are trying to make a movie. Okay, it's kind of the equivalent of the um, Scarlett Johansson in Ghost in the Shell thing. They didn't, it wasn't that they were trying to whitewash even though they explained that BS in the movie. It was because, I mean, it was obvious. That they were trying to, they were, they were trying to, um, basically cat, um, they were trying to capitalize on her popularity. I mean, yeah, she's a popular actress, so, and, you know, they wanted to capitalize on that. Now, I'm assuming that this is the same thing, okay? Well, Smith is a huge actor. Like, as an actor, his biggest problem is that he's too big. He has that face. Like, when you're watching, when you're watching a movie, like, for instance, Suicide Squad, like, did he, like, he wasn't the dead shot from the comics, but he was still entertaining. And the thing is, like, even though he wasn't dead shot who in the comics as a white guy, uh, he's, he was still, like, he was, you didn't even see him as Deadshot. You saw him as Will Smith playing Deadshot. Like, yeah, he's like so big he has one of those faces. That's just my opinion, but let's read more. Clarence Hill Jr. was supported by the likes of film writer Valerie Complex, 
She describes the casting as colorism at work. And George M. Johnson, who wrote, just like Chadwick Boseman, um, shouldn't be playing Thurgood, Thurgood Marshall, I don't know who that is. I don't know what movie he's referring to. Uh, Will should not, uh, should not play Richard. Colorism describes prejudice or discrimination of same race people based solely on skin color. Many have pointed out the obvious, um, obvious that Smith's lighter skin tone does not match Richard Williams' darker skin tone. As Johnson points out, Chadwick Boseman faced similar backlash over the casting of Thurgood uh, Marshall. Zoe Saldana, cast as Nina Simone in the biopic Nina, was also met with colorism uh, controversy. In that film, darker makeup was applied to Saldana so that her uh, lighter skin tone could match Simone's. Okay? I mean, that makes sense. I don't know about that, but she... Uh, hold on, let me let me see when this uh, Nina movie came out. Because I, I don't want my next uh, statement to be ignorant. Because... Okay, 2018. Oh, 2016. So I guess it would be ignorant. I was going to say it was probably the same thing. Where, uh, where she got notoriety from playing Valkyrie in Thor Ragnarok, but uh, who knows? Maybe she got notoriety from something, some from somewhere else. But yeah, if they're so, if there's, if SJW is gonna be so offended, why don't you just use the same color shader that they use in Will Smith to turn them blue? Okay, or are you guys gonna get mad that he was culturally appropriating Smurfs? Just saying. Okay, okay. Colorism matters. Love Will Smith. Yet you love him so much you couldn't even capitalize his name, dumbass. <laughs> but there are other black actors for this role. Colorism at work. Just like Chad, uh, Chadwick shouldn't, uh, should, shouldn't have played Thurgood Marshall. Will should not play Richard. Colorism or skin color matters in how folks were treated in that. I navigate spaces. Is Alexandra Ship playing Venus? Okay. Is the makeup artist from Nina available? <laughs> that that's funny. That's funny. Okay, I guess that's the end of the article. But yeah, those are my thoughts for real. Oh, what are yours? Uh put that in the comment section. If you like this video, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Uh, for well, if you like the video, hit the like button, hit the bell for notifications. I will catch you guys next time. Stay tuned, and I will see you soon. Have a shootout, run up in the bank, bus grabbing all the loot out. Whoop somebody ass, taking my boot out right on TV, so all y'all can see me. Just ignorant, attack, acting rough. I mean, then will I be black enough? Oh wait, maybe I'll jack the truck full of cigarettes, guns, and drugs and stuff.